going to teach you how to take two-dimensional paper and turn them into three-dimensional works of art. I have two pieces of paper, one that's a lined notebook, one that's just I tore out from a magazine. You can use any paper you wish, any paper you have laying around. The first thing that you are going to do is take a marker and you're just going to draw straight lines from one end of your paper all the way to the other end of your paper. It is your choice whether you draw your lines the short way like I'm doing or the long way. You'll have longer strips of paper once you cut them. Now it's time to cut your paper. If you want to cut more than one sheet at a time, you can stack your papers and just use these lines as a guide to cut however many paper you want to cut. And remember, slow and low, that is the tempo. If you want to cut me, you gotta go slow. Be sure to aim your scissors to cut along the line you drew. It's sort of like trying to walk on a balance beam when you are in PE. You're really focusing on getting your scissor right on that line. Now I'm just being silly and going way too fast. Now I have a bunch of paper strips. I'm going to neaten up my pile of paper strips and I'm going to pick one out. The first thing that I want you to do is just make a little fold on one end and a little fold on the other end. All you have to do is pop it up and now you have an arch. Now get another paper strip. All right, the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to fold. Right, then we're going to flip it, fold, flip, Fold, flip, fold, flip, fold, flip, fold, flip, fold. Now we have a zigzag paper. Boing, 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 boing. Now get another paper strip. To make a spiral, we're going to use a marker. You can use a pencil or a marker, anything that's round. And you are going to put the end of the paper around your pencil. And you're going to roll and roll and roll and roll. Uh-oh, it's going up my pencil. I'm going to push it down. Roll and roll and roll. Twist your paper tightly around your pencil and boing. Now we have a nice spiral. Boingy, boingy, boing. Let's see what you can do with your paper strips. Don't forget to subscribe.